that one piece that I did, wish I'd cut more. Now I don't know if I'm going to get much out of it. Um, I'm going to try to come in right in here. I got to miss this obviously. So in order to miss those, I got to be three quarters. I want a one inch piece. So let's see. Hopefully that'll hold it. Hopefully it'll hold it. Find out. I'd rather try than miss the opportunity to get some. Let's see where, let's see where an inch, like say inch and a quarter looks like. Eh, I think we can get something out of that. Well, hurt to try. tricky with a little thin board because I mean that clamp is just barely holding there but sometimes it'll hold it sometimes it won't now this side's not going to have much look to it it's the other side we only need one side to look pretty but I hate to waste the opportunity to have a nice board one inch thick board will yield a three quarter. Uh, so get that up above there. Let's see what we got. You ready? Are you ready? It's going to be pretty. It's going to be pretty. Let's flip it over. Let me uh, dust it off here and get it cleaned up a little bit. Fortunately, it's dried out a little bit on this side. I need a little water on it. So, it's dried out a bit. So, let's go ahead. We've gone through all this trouble. Can't really see it. It's dirty. Let's throw it in the back of the Kubota and run over to the water faucet and throw some water on it. All right. Now we got over here. It's a little hard. I got some water. Let's go ahead and do some water on it. See what we got. It's a miracle. It's amazing when it dries out. You can't see it well. And we'll throw a little water on it and get a close up. It's good to get it washed off to begin with. It's amazing what a little finish of water will do to bring out the uh, features in it. I don't think there'll be much on the back. The 
because it uh, doesn't have much of the heartwood in it. We'll see. Doesn't hurt to wash it off so it doesn't have any stuff on it in the pile while it's drying. Get it clean. Like I said, eventually I start taking some of the bark off this stuff. So, let's spin it around and I'll show you what we got. I think it was worth it. Hate to throw that over the wood over in the wood pile somewhere. So uh that little teeny piece of sliver that was left off made a nice one inch board like that. I mean the cherry is just most of our cherries is always beautiful stuff. Man's we got dark cherry here. A little bit of wave there in it. So I think that was worth taking an extra 10 or 15 minutes to throw them back on the mill and see if we could get a board out of it. What do y'all think? You think it was worth the extra effort? Because these are some of my prettiest boards I do when I finish up uh, stuff. And they're number one seller when I sell stuff to other people. So, all right, there you go. There's a pretty one for you.